Welcome back to uh, Flavor Town, Population Me, for another episode of Takeout Thursday. You'll notice that uh, for once it's light outside. That's because the place I went to closes at 8 or 9, depending on the weekday. Or on Wednesdays, it doesn't close uh, until 2 a.m., I think. And that's because it's uh, it's not in the plaza, it's right on campus. It is called the Bomb Shelter, or uh, Bomber. I got a uh, chicken panini with uh, spinach dip, something like that, and a side. I'll just open this then. This would be a lot easier with two hands. Moist towelettes, very cool. Hey, this is a pretty big box. Uh, let me just get my Rodman School of Management mug for scale. It is very big. I think it's the biggest box I've had so far. Quite a big box. And uh, quite a big meal, I think. Not sure how this stacks up to the other ones. So there it is, the chicken panini, I think with spinach and artichoke dip. And the side is the hashtag fries, that's what they call it. I think everybody else calls it waffle fries. Alright, got my spoon, my knife, my fork, my salt and pepper, uh, another napkin. Yep. So now, let me just... Look at that, look at all that dip. Very cool, very nice, I like it. Well, I don't know if I like it, I haven't even uh, bit into it yet. Okay, uh, here goes. So the uh, sandwich itself is pretty good. I think they got jalapeno cheese or something in there. And the fries are pretty good too. Or the one fry I had was pretty good. I think the bread there is fried. Not really into that, I guess, but it's not an issue for me. Very tasty, probably unhealthy dish, a plate, whatever. Uh, something I'm definitely not enjoying is the uh, price tag. Oof, $12.99 before tax, and comes out to something like $14. Don't know where my receipt is. It's probably somewhere around here, I remember having it. But uh, once I uh, edit the video, I'll put the uh, actual prices up on there. Let me just <laughs> the sandwich is uh, really good. I'd probably enjoy it more if I didn't have to, you know, walk it over here. It's probably best uh, eating in, I think. There is a bar, so if you're like me, you can eat alone. Uh, you can also eat with friends if you have those, if they're not busy. Now, what else can I say about this? Let me just... Very big, as you can see. Yeah, the, uh, the fries are much more like wedges than, uh, than fries in that they're uh, not really crispy so much as uh, thick. Like wedges. If you've ever had wedges, they're like that. Except uh, there's more surface area. It's a lot more textured. Portion as it looks right now is comparable to, say, Lizzie's or something. Or uh, Mr. Panino's, maybe. Um, it's a big box, but that's to keep everything from, uh, touching, I guess. It's definitely good food. It's really convenient, but, you know, that's just one aspect of, uh, what I'm aiming for. It's convenient in that it's on campus, but, you know, since it doesn't stay open until 10 or 11, it's easier for me to just, uh, get plaza food on the way home from the library, which I should be at right now. <laughs> the portion is, uh just about what I expect for, you know, restaurant food. And the price is also what I expect from restaurant food. I understand that's not their fault, it's something about uh, renting out the space and uh, some kind of university regulation. Yeah, so, yeah, it tastes good, portion's decent, price is uh, much too high for me to keep coming back. So, uh, I'll put the scores up in the white text, just over there. I think that would wrap it up for uh, 
for this week's Takeout Thursday. Like I said, good food. Um, I would uh, definitely recommend you check this place out. Go with your friends, it's good times. Uh, eat alone, it's probably also good times. Bring it back home and uh, record yourself eating it. Uh, probably the best times. Nothing more fun than this. Nowhere else I'd rather be. Thanks for watching and uh, see you next week on Takeout Thursday. I won't see you. You won't even see me. Uh, if it's still light outside like it is now. Uh, but, you know, if it's dark, you will definitely see me. Or either way, you'll uh, see my hands. So thanks for watching. And for the third or fourth time, bye.